There's nothing really to fucking highlight, man. The press conference was what it was. And um, it was nothing exciting. You know, these guys don't really have too much character. And that kind of, you know what I'm saying, surprises me considering all of this shit. Andy Pop, all in social media and everything leading up to the fight and the rematch, calling him a robot and shit. But you don't have that same energy in the press conference for the biggest heavyweight fight of the year. Why? Is it because you're humble? We can't call you that because we know you're not humble. Why is it because, you know, you're a fan of Anthony Joshua? Well, we can't call you that anymore because we know your true colors and we know that you think he's a robot. Do you think you can beat Anthony Joshua? Absolutely so. But the one, uh, absolutely, that's what you're telling people. But do you believe that to be true? I can't honestly say that I do. Because to be perfectly honest here... Check this. The baddest man on the planet. <laughs> the baddest man on the planet. <laughs> you know that that is a direct shot at Deontay Wilder. They coming straight at Wilder. Hard, too. You know what I'm saying? Straight out hard, okay? Alexander Music is now the baddest man on the planet. He also says that out of all the heavyweights, Deontay Wilder is the easiest person to fight. The easiest, he said, his most difficult would be Tyson Fury. He said, but Deontay Wilder is the weakest link. That's what he's saying. Now, I know what you Wilder fans are saying. Oh, fuck Uzi. I wish to see. Deontay Wilder said himself that he is not going to fight Anthony Joshua in April. He wants Tyson Fury. Ben Davidson said himself that Deontay Wilder needs to fight Anthony Joshua. Tyson Fury is not really tripping on Deontay Wilder right now. This is what Ben Davidson said via IFL TV. Shout out IFL TV. Deontay Welcome back to another edition of Fanboys and Haters Exposed. We're just going to dig right into it and we start with Power Beast. And he states, Canelo knows Andrade would box circles around him, make him look terrible, expose him for the fraud he is. Canelo is a hype job boosted by his fanboys. He hasn't fought anybody because they're all ducking him just like him. First of all, the end of your statement didn't make sense, but I understand what you're saying. You're trying to say that Canelo Alvarez is a hype job and Demetrius Andre would expose him. But that makes no sense when you see that Canelo Alvarez is the face of boxing, just now hitting his prime, and already has a legendary status of a career, has one of the best resumes, if not the best resume in boxing. So you have to be honest and unbiased, Canelo Alvarez is far from Del Cotto. Then you cash clowns. And when the, the best fight the best, when the best finally fights the best, oftentimes it goes wrong. We've seen it with Earl Spence Jr. versus Sean Porter. When the best fight the best goes wrong. We've seen it now with Devrinchenko, Gennady Golovkin. When the best fight the best goes wrong. Canelo versus Danny Jacobs. When the best fights the best goes wrong. <laughs> Deontay Wilder. You ain't, you ain't, you ain't, I ain't the we dream was out there. Nobody was talking about him. And I got hey, and I'm gonna say it again. Anthony Joshua brought life back to the heavyweight division. He brought life back to the heavyweight division, but y'all don't show him no respect. Y'all don't give that man no respect. He brought life back to the heavyweight division. He brought big money back to the heavyweight division. Let me run that beat back, man. Yo, my dogs, make sure you hit that like button, comment, subscribe, but obviously hit the bell for notifications.
So first things first, I've got to give a big shout out to my dog, Pat O.D. for signing up to the certified exclusive Patreon. Big ups my man. Anyway, moving on. Andy Margin Boo Louise, aka Mr. Big Bell, aka <laughs> Mr. Michelin Man, has sent a warning shot to Anthony Joshua. The article reads, Andy Louise warns AJ, I'll be lighter, faster and more. Boxing finesse, and I'm back again with another banger. Anyways, man. It's your boy H. Mister the Zone. Yeah, nigga. Ain't no sleeping, nigga. I'm on your bitch ass, nigga. You a bitch ass, nigga. Real talk, nigga. What you gotta say to your fans, nigga? What you gotta say to your fans about me, dog? What you just gonna avoid the fight? You gonna duck me? Yeah, nigga. I'ma do this shit for T Street, nigga. Real talk. I'ma knock your bitch. True boxing news will come to the MBBC non biased boxing community, non biased boxing crew, the realest boxing channels on YouTube. NBBC.